just lit a candle on behalf of James and Sharon. They want to remember those from their family and friends who have gone before them. This is such a special day. Such a special day for John and Breda, for James and Eileen, and for all the Monaghan and Cooney families and extended families. You are very welcome. And surely nobody is more welcome than Emily. Welcome to the family. Now, Cooney, now he's a now. Sharon's, Sharon's a beautiful bride, and James has scrubbed up fairly well, too, although I think it took a few goals to get all the milk and butter off him. So I just want to wish them all the best for the future. The sooner the new home started, and can look forward to many happy years there with Emily and all going well, maybe a, a few more to keep her company. Sharon, do you consent to be my wife? I do. James, do you consent to be my husband? I do. each other truly, for better or for worse, for richer or poorer, in sickness and in health, all the years of my life. Every time we came to that part of the ceremony he said, let's do that part again, and every time I said what I did, he kissed her, and now that he can, he didn't, so we'll applaud again, and he might. My wife. <laughs> uh, thanks for everything you've done for me and Emily this last while. I like you done all this here today. I like I don't know how you done it, but my stress is right. And 
Well, you were praying for the weather. All them candles I lit this morning were got the weather. No, me and Emily Vaughan, thank you so much for being there for us. Silence and give a very warm welcome to the Living Young Couples, Sharon James.